What's up everybody, it's CMP with Craftmaster Productions and Studio12Tutorials.com. Don't forget to stop by Studio One Tutorials, pick up your premium membership, it's 50 cents a day. If you do pick up your premium membership, hit me up in the Discord, ask me about anything. It is the only place we do requests and it's not just for Studio One Tutorials. Also, please stop by the new and improved CMPKids.com. Introduce yourself to Tick, introduce yourself to Pupil of Society, Asha Cole, Money Mikes, and Shane. New packs out now. Um, today we're gonna be focusing on a pack that is um, a MIDI-based product. We're gonna, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to get around the browser um, and just uh, just be really fast with, um, with Studio One, right? So um, if you guys have seen the product in the MIDI files, um, you know, playlist, playlist MIDI, um, volumes one through five, pretty much we take uh, popular albums from, you know, given whichever, whatever is dominating the playlist, we transcribe to MIDI drums, and we give them to you. What makes Playlist MIDI so powerful is the fact that it is MIDI, it's customizable, and it's mix and match. So, for example, I've got, uh, you know, I've got the stuff from, uh, from Solid Gold MIDI here, right? And, you know, we've got... We've got the songs and they've got their BPM, but it really it, it really doesn't matter. The way that the way that I like to use this product is I can is I can go and have a loop up like this. And then, you know, um, just grab a snare and just kind of just kind of uh, put it into put it into the file. Now, if I want to, if if I want to audition different combinations, it's really easy inside the Studio One browser. All I have to do is click on one of these hi hats, and because that's what I'm going to audition. And then what you want to do is you want to select the track that has your hi hats on it. So I have a sample one here with a hi hat selected. And now if I just press, if I just press play on my track and then play down here in the browser. So say I like this hi hat. Now I can go ahead. Now I can go ahead and grab it, put it into put it into the um, arrange window. Go ahead and select a kick now, and find a kick pattern that works. I like that. I'm not even gonna think about it too much. Right. Just go ahead and grab that. Grab this 808 pattern. And then, you know, depending, depending on how creative uh, you want to get with everything, you go ahead and duplicate this over. And then maybe you keep, maybe you keep the, uh, the kick in the 808 pattern. But you take, you know, you take a, you take a hi hat from another section. And it just makes it super easy to, to, to maintain your creativity to maintain originality, but you, you just have to do less clicking and programming. Like I, like, I don't know if you guys actually like clicking little boxes when you're making music, but I don't. So this is why I create these shortcuts so that I could stay in a musical flow um, and then find something where I like the vibe of it, make a quick little edit, make it my own, maintain originality and keep moving forward and having fun so this is cmp with craftmaster productions studio one tutorials.com cmp kits volumes one through five midi drums available now five albums worth of material in every volume